Are you happy with the media? Yes, I am. You are okay. 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 You are okay only to find a number of policemen there and uh, they were first detected by my children who woke me up uh, to tell me that there were policemen uh, uh, outside they were milling around so i decided to go out and invite them in and uh, they said that uh, they had a warrant to search my house and I told them that uh, before you do that, I will invite my lawyer to be present. So my lawyer came and they did the search. Uh, they took some documents and uh, we, they asked me a few questions if I had guns in the, in, the, in, the, in, the, in the house. What business do I do with Baba? And then they said they had some few issues to ask me about Kakamega County. Uh, when I came here, I told them I was not in a position to answer any question until I'm pro pro uh, briefed on issues that I'm supposed to comment on. So that I, I acquaint myself on the issues because you know very well, uh, I left the county one year ago and I'm not privy to the documents that they have from the county. And also, they, were, they wanted issues to do with 2013, 2014, which obviously I could not remember. So uh, we have been here. Um, they studied the interviews, but they could not go far because I could not remember some of the issues. So they, they, we agreed that they will avail the, the issues to me so that I can come later uh, to clarify on some of the issues. Mm, so which were some of these issues? Uh, they, they never told me the issues. They said they wanted to interview me and they were saying mostly it was on procurement. Yeah. Do you think it's political? Obviously this is a political yes. and you can see that I have been uh, in the county for 10 years. No ESCC came to my office even one day. And I've been away one, one year since I, I, since I left governorship. Nobody came my way on any investigation. I was minister for planning. Nobody came to my office for any investigation. So I would wonder why when I have retired that someone is coming to ask me about 2013, 2014. Is that fair to me? No. Yeah. So this is all politics, and we shall deal with it politically. Correct. Yeah. Correct. Do you yeah. think he's to the to Western uh, yeah. over the weekend? That? The president is also visiting Western. That's why the, that's why the yeah. 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 Maybe, that maybe they are leading. Yeah, maybe that's mm. what they are, they, yeah, that they are, they are mm. linking to. Yes. I, I wasn't aware that he was visiting anyway. Yeah, so maybe that is the case. Okay. Yes. The ground is hostile. Yes. Yeah. Um, any other question? Uh, so when are you coming back maybe or they have to come? They told me they will communicate to me when I should come back. And I told them any time they communicate to me, I'm free to come. Yes. Yes. Did they mention any figures of the amount they have? No, they never. They never. I, 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 I have just been hearing that they have been interviewing some contractors. Yeah, but uh, I have not had time to sit with those contractors. And since, furthermore, I have left the county, I'm not privy to any information about the county. I cannot access any document of the county because I'm no longer an employee of the county. Did they take anything from your house? Yes, they took. Uh, they took some documents from my house. Yes. Thank you. Man. Yes. And, was, was the and those are personal documents. Uh, by the way, I. I, I, I was not arrested as such. I volunteered myself to come here because I needed my phone. So when I came here, 
because they told me I, I could remain. Then I signed for the documents they have taken. Then they will call me when to come. But I insisted, because I have only one phone, let me come. Because they had taken my phone. And when I came here, the boss who was supposed to approve the, uh, the, uh, approve the release of the phone was not there. So we had to wait for a longer time. In the process, they said, why can't we ask you a few questions? Then I said, I can't be asked uh, impromptu questions. I must prepare myself and I must know what I'm going to be asked so that I respond effectively. You are very unprepared. Uh-huh. You require the same? Okay, okay. Governor, will this affect the current talks between the two sides of the government? I, 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 can, I can't say, but obviously we, we, we were in these talks in good faith. When this happens, and I'm one of the principals of, of, of all Asimio, you know, obviously it will affect the talks. Because even Baba was calling everybody out there. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, Sidio. <laughs> Wanatuma tu habari ya tetungojea dakika mbili, dakika mbili, tangu niingia ni masaa mawili. Hakuna kasi nafanya hapa kwa hivyo. Mimi naenda bila kujua kama atafunguliwa au hafunguliwi. Hiyo tabia, sio tabia ya watu ambao wanafuata sheria. Hiyo tabia ni tabia ya magaidi. He is being held. Nyaundi advocate. But he called me a senior counsel even though Nyaundi was there. They refused to open. So it's like uh, the investigators are choosing how many lawyers and which lawyer can be with Oparanya. So there are so many of us down there. He had called Dunstan. He has called Sifuna. Babu is there. This is Wandai out here and Kioni. So they keep on saying that he'll come down in 15 minutes. It is more than two hours since I entered there. So do you have and I have told them to say whether they are arresting him, whether he is going to be detained. Nobody can stop them if they wish to detain him, but let them not play a uh, cat and mouse game. So as I leave, I do not know what they want with him. But I know they have chosen which lawyer he can be with. I do not know what they are doing. To a man they took in the morning, who has not eaten and who has been taken together with his family members. Do you think it is uh, political? Oh, you are addressing the media. Obviously. Uh, uh, comments by my colleagues that uh, this is uh, it's amazing, uh, to say the least, um, that at this time and age, with our new constitution that is uh, celebrated all over the world, we will still see people behaving this way. Of course, with uh, Pastor Oginde, we thought that this place would be better. We didn't see uh, Archbishop Wabukara uh, allowing ESEC to go to behave this way. So you can actually see a de degeneration of uh, our country going down the drain slowly. Uh, and uh, one more thing that I want to say, we are engaged in the dialogue, national dialogue. How do you dialogue when people are being harassed behind your backs? Where is the good faith? What would motivate me to go to the table tomorrow? I don't think they have any reason um, to tell us that they really believe in the talks. I think what Gachagua is saying, and I'm going to say that I'm going to say that I'm Obviously, as you can see, we are locked out of the ESEC premises. Uh, public premises, of course, and this is uh, definitely against the law and the constitution. These premises are financed by taxpayers from all walks of life, and it is a premises that need to be accessible to every Kenyan, every Kenyan, and therefore this 
conduct uh, is unbecoming and is totally unacceptable. They are basically turning the country into a police state. They are taking the country back to the dark old days of dictatorship. If you arrest a Kenyan on whatever grounds, you must allow him to access his lawyers. You must allow him to access his friends. You must allow him to access his supporters, if he has any. You can't keep somebody in communicado for even a minute, because the Constitution doesn't allow that. Doesn't allow that. And therefore, we take great exception uh, to this decision by the ESCC to barricade these promises and bar us from accessing the Honorable Weekly for our Ambassador Oparanya. As far as we are concerned, Oparanya is innocent until charged in a court of law with whatever offences, tried and convicted. And even if he is convicted, he still has his rights under the Constitution to be accessed by his lawyers, by his friends, by his supporters. We are not going to leave this place until we establish the whereabouts of Wycliffe Oparanya. Thank you.